Hi everyone, I'm Gina R, and I'm back with a mail call, and a very large one at that. I got some pretty large packages in the mail this time around, and let me try to open this one up. In fact, you know what? Let me pause before I cut myself. Okay, I finally got that box open. Managed not to slice or lose any fingers. Okay, this comes actually from Treasure Hog. And he does uh, pork rinds. So he sent a really cool sticker. I cannot wait to put that on my sticker board. Look at that. Roses, razor rinds. Get your fix at the uh, rate i can't read the bottom part but that is so cool oh it's their uh website there you go let me see if i can focus it let me zoom in that usually helps there we go that's the website roses razor and he was on walker magnet and they featured him. And look at that. Oh my goodness. These are huge. And I do love pork rinds. Look at that. Oh, I can't wait to sink my teeth into these. Wow. This is 1.5 ounces. That's the net weight. And this is their original mix. They have it in different flavors. I went ahead and went with the original. I'm not much into uh, spices. Maybe pepper here and there, but really not much. Oops, sorry about that. So, wow. These, oh, I can't wait to sink my teeth into that. That is so cool. So I'll leave a link down below to Treasures Hogs uh, website so that you can go and see if you would be interested in any of those. Those are nice. In fact, I just got an idea. So uh, anyway, I'll share that idea at a later time. But these are really, really cool. So let me go now and open up the next package. Okay, I took advantage of Sticker Mule. They always have specials and stuff like that. And so I went ahead and ordered something. Look at that, that's really cool. That I would try out. And these are actually bigger and nicer than what I thought they were gonna be. And what it is, I had gotten these mailers, look at that, wow. I'm like, that is awesome. And it's just plain in the back. And uh, I really, really do like these. So I picked that up at Sticker Mule. And now let me get the next item up. Okay, I'm a big fan of Rob Finds Treasures, and I was in desperate need of updating my coin roll mats. And so what I did was I went ahead and got the clad uh, coin gauge variety. And I like it because it has the circles up on top. So when you do your finds, you want them on top, not in the bottom. Like the cash collectibles have them in the bottom. And so I would bump them and knock them over. And I, I just didn't really like it. But I really like that part of uh, Rob Finds Treasure's uh, coin mats. Was that he had the spots up here in the top. And it talks about the Eisenhower, the Susan B. Anthony dollar. And I'm going to mispronounce this. I always do the Sakasawea dollar. The presidential dollar. The half dollar quarters and dimes so it talks about what errors to look for what varieties um also uh, you know if there's a double die 
free verse or obverse and you know so that's pretty interesting so that's for the clad and i'll be doing a lot more penny hunts and i'm looking forward to hopefully doing a penny battle with walker magnet so we'll keep you posted as soon as we do that once i get settled into the new house it's going to be penny box battle. So I like this. This is really, really nice. So that's pretty much what I got in the mail this time around. I want to thank you for watching. And until next time, happy hunting, happy collecting. And I can't wait to try those out. Thank you, Treasure Hog.